Hey, what's up guys? Jeremy with Everything iDevice, and in this video I'm going to be going over an awesome tweak in Cydia called iTypewriter. Now basically what this tweak will do is alter the sound effects of your keyboard to sound very accurately like a old school typewriter machine. And it also gives you the ability to have haptic feedback with your keyboard clicks as well. So even if you didn't like the typewriter sounds, you could just get the tweak for the haptic feedback. And if you don't know what the haptic feedback is, basically your keyboard will vibrate every time you click it. So, you know, it kind of registers a little bit, you know, better on your fingers feeling that vibration when you click a button. So uh, let's just give it a go and uh, check out these sound effects. Very cool, in my opinion. So as you can see, it does sound very accurately like an old school typewriter machine. And uh, that's something, if you're using it in public, would probably definitely get someone's attention. So uh, let's just jump over to the settings and I'll show you uh, something you do have to do with this uh, tweak in order for it to work properly. So here is the settings for iTypewriter. I'm just going to back out here. So I have the typewriter sound on at the top there. You will have to disable your normal keyboard click sound in order for this to work right so under sounds just go to keyboard clicks and make sure you turn that off otherwise this won't work properly now I'm just gonna go ahead and I'm gonna go back into iTypewriter I'm gonna turn the sound effect off and I'm gonna turn the haptic feedback on so you can get an idea of what that sounds like basically so Uh, as you can hear, it's vibrating. I gotta click it a lot for the vibrates to sound, you know. So that's what the haptic feedback is. It basically just vibrates for every uh, key you push. And that's basically it. Again, it's called iTypewriter. It is 99 cents from the Mod My I repo. I think this thing is actually really cool. Uh, let me know what you guys think about it down in the comments. This is Jeremy with Everything iDevice, and I'll catch you guys later.